Hey everyone, I'm really excited because I am going to actually walk with you through this little thing that I have, which is my first green stock garden package. I'm really excited. Um, I just want to unbox it with you all because this is something that I'm going to work to do this year is try to garden some actual herbs and some vegetables and kind of live from my own produce so we'll see how it goes i'm going to set this up on my tripod so bear with me because y'all know i don't be editing nothing y'all can see my apartment some i rearranged this morning so i'm gonna try to set the box over here um all right so here is the box let me turn that put y'all in full view I've been waiting to unbox this because I wanted to do it while recording so y'all can see the progression between what this looks like right now, when I actually get it going, and we'll just see how it turns out. I've never actually grown anything to eat. I do have a few different plants that I have on my balcony, but we are going to try to actually eat some produce this year save some money as well. So, let me go ahead. They were not playing about the safety. This is packaged nice and tight. Ugh. So, whew, this is like a real time unboxing. I'm not, <laughs> I'm trying to show y'all exactly what it is. I've been eyeing this company for a while now and I uh oh this is cool in here you can't fully see it there it is this is the stuff that I purchased which is one seven tier leaf green vertical planter which they were having a sale um one insect cover check one lid for the top of it because I don't want any bugs to get in my water source and then one spinner and tube movie thingy to help me rotate it. So that's really cool that they had that. I was waiting on a sale and I'm still actually waiting for the original planter, vertical planter to be on sale because I want to grow some um, bigger vegetables, some larger ones. These, this one is good for like herbs and small root uh, vegetables. So. I'm waiting for the original planter to go on sale. I'm watching their Instagram. They're a great family owned business uh, out of Knoxville, Tennessee, right? So support small owned businesses. Oh, this is exciting. Let's see what it is. Okay. Let's see what this looks like. So here we have, awesome. This is the spinner. I will put the wheels at the bottom here and this will give me something to be able to turn my um, vertical planter on so it can get different sunlight in different directions, which will be really helpful. This is so cute. So here is the lid. This comes separately. Um, you don't technically need it, I think, for the vertical planter, but I'm always prone to getting insects in my plants, um, even just the regular plants I have. So. I was like, let me make sure that they don't get in the water source or anything else that's not really supposed to be in the water source. Um, so I just wanted to purchase this. It's only $12, so you can't go wrong. And it matches the vertical planter, this green one. They have a lot of cute colors right now, and that's why I'm really hoping they go on sale again so that I can purchase some other ones. And then, okay. This nice little, oh, this is the insect cover and it leaves you a little cute note here that says that it's been sewn together with love by, it looks like Jan, J-R, I'm not really sure, J-C but this was individually sewn together for me that's very cute and it's a personalized little note how sweet i love it and then 
good packaging. We have, oh, here's, oh, Daniel S. Thank you. It says my green stock was packaged by him. This is such a cute little touch. How sweet. I love it. Thank you, Daniel. I'll be keeping that. The wheels that go to my spinner that I sh showed you, the base. Perfect. These are the individual tiers. When you stack the uh, each of the rows of the vertical planter, you put one of these in, it will help with the distribution of the water. Really important. So we have all of those. Then we have Open Me, green stock setup instructions. How pretty. This is just so, so cute. So it has the little instructions. You get to see the family on the back. How helpful, a little guide, everything in here. It tells you what you can plant. This is just really cute, I love it. Y'all, y'all don't even know this little city girl is about to be planting this year. I'm so excited. And I'm not gonna pull all of these out. This looks like it's the water reservoir at the top that goes at the very, very top of your vertical planter, um, which the lid that I showed earlier is made to cover, right? So that's perfect. Keeps things out. Love that. And this is what I'm not going to pull all of these out because this, you want to put that here are each of the individual um, planters. So I'll fill these, stack them, and I'm be planting. I'm so excited. And they're really deep, actually. And they also come with the draining uh, tubes that you need as well. This is really nice. Even though they say that these are for smaller vegetables, they still got pretty good depth. And so I'm excited to try it out. Um, I hope y'all continue to follow along in my journey. Uh, I'm just really excited. I'm a little fake homestead girl. I'm from Wisconsin, so it's a little bit in my blood, but I'm in the city now. So I'm really going to try to show y'all how city living meshes with homestead living and do my little uh, generic off-brand pioneer woman. So follow the journey.